Tinder. It's the dating app where the crude go to get lewd, the clap to get slapped, the nitty to get sticky. Anyone can get laid. Provided they're of legal age consent to the right and the- Anyone can get laid on Tinder. I wanted to test this theory that anyone could get laid on Tinder. So, I chose one of the most controversial characters in modern movie history. Borat. So if this man could get laid, I believe anyone could. So I went on this dating app, set up the profile, and I posed the question, could Borat get laid on Tinder? Okay! Disclaimer, the statements made here are references to the two movies all for comedic purpose, not to display disrespect towards any gender, race, or country. This is not designed to cause discomfort or offense purely for entertainment purposes. Thank you. We have left the account for about 48 hours, posing as Borat himself. I was hitting up Galley left, right, and center. And now, I'm gonna read you some of the replies. Okay, so first things first, there was a... a sports journalist. Uh, his name was Hamish. And we went for, Hello, my name is Borat. You will be my boyfriend, yes? He replied with, Your suit is grey. Not. Haha. Uh -huh. A reference. <laughs> Sorry, I was just leaving the uh, massive pause for laughter that was expected there. No, there wasn't one? Ah, uh, okay, uh. Next person, okay. A guy named David. He actually messaged Borat first. And he said, Yamash! I replied with, Well, are you? Uh? He went, How are you? You can't open up a conversation with Yamash and then continue like, I didn't just reply with some random sound. I replied with, Very nice. I visit US of A and was very nice. I bring back to Kazakhstan and now I visit Kingdom that is united to do new subsequent movie film. How are the you doing? You can clearly get the vibe I'm going for here, right? He went with, I'm very well, thanks. Going to walk the dog now. What? React! This man was unfazed by anything I was saying. He was fully in it to get some from Bora. He was ready for the saggy from Saggy Dev. Next was next. We had the same opening line. Uh, hello, my name is Borat. Great success. We had the matchy matchy on the Tinder. Of course. Yes. He replied with, oh my God, this is amazing. I love you. Haha. <laughs> I have some bad news for... For this G. Imagine you were looking for an award-winning actor and you got me. Okay, so now we're getting into a few of the longer answers, uh, the actual conversations that we had. This one was with Nikolai. Hello, my name is Borat. Great success we had the matchy-matchy on the Tinder. Hello, Borat. Me, Nikolai, from the country Bulgaria. Happy we did a match too. You look a very beautiful man. Oh, saucy. Many thanks. I, from Kazakhstan, the glorious country, but it had problem too. Economic, social, Jew, of course. Reference to the movie. Reference. Bulgaria many problem too. A lot of gypsies. A gypsy stole my grandma bucket and me had to send money for her buying new one. But me like all people, as these great singer-songwriter is a gypsy and have great music. My man, I was getting a recommendation halfway through my shit. Aziz, this guy, he's fully real. I thought he was chatting shit. He looks like a mafia member. He looks like he fucked me up, to be honest. But I'm glad I got the recommendation from Nikolai. Thank you for the Bulgarian music. We continue the conversation, though. Ah, gypsies is terrible problem. They shrink all the peoples into teeny peeny treasures and sell you. I recommend find Mr. Saraziz and collect tears and music to protect from the AIDS, yes? Okay, when coronavirus pandemic stops, we fly to Bulgaria to find Sir Mamaziz. High five! We have great time! See you soon, Mr. Nikolai! <laughs> Bro, we smashed it! As soon as coronavirus is over, Nikolai and I are gonna bang out Aziz. <laughs> the next talk I'd also say was a great success. This one was probably the best conversation I had. It was with a girl called Mai or May, I don't know how to say her name, but she was fully having it. I liked it. Are you one of the lady women from the US of A? She went, no, no, I'm lady woman from UK. I said, ah, the kingdom that is united, great success. I must venture there next for sexy time and research for Kazakhstan ministry, yes? She went, yes, yes, lots of sexy time with many beautiful ladies. <laughs> Boy, we were in! Okay, so next conversation I had was also with another fucking legend. It was actually, um... <laughs> the guy was also from Kazakhstan. Hey, Borat, what a coincidence. I'm also from Kazakhstan. I went, ah, very nice. So you're also a fan of running of Jews, yes? Oh, it's like I was trying to offend people. But he took it in good stride. He went, no, I actually had only good experience with Jews. I thought you were from Kazakhstan, Borat. We are not Germans after all. Oh my day. My guy fully said it. He was coming for smoke, bro. Absolute legend. Alazar, literally from Kazakhstan and took it in good stride. 
I love this G. Oh my god, he's great. Speaking of love, last message I'm going to show you guys. It was from a guy named Harry. Short and sweet. Guess what it was? I went for you will be my boyfriend. My name is Borat. He went yes. So in conclusion, the experiment was a great success, which proves my theory. Anyone can get laid on Tinder. I'm just going to pause the video here. Um, anyone can get laid on Tinder. Visibly, except me. Uh, my Valentine's Day was pretty lonely this year, and uh, you're watching a video of me pretending to be a Borat. I'm the saddest man you can take this advice from. Any random ideas, leave them in the comments down below. Leave that like, leave that subscribe. You know what that is, and see you guys later. I know a lot of people are going to question the validity of this video, and I don't blame you. They're gonna be like, oh no, he didn't do it, he's bullshit. <laughs> well, if you start that way, you clearly don't know me. Covering that half of the screen so you don't see my, my shit, but <laughs> that's as real as it gets, boy. Jokers don't think I do my challenges properly.